This is WYMT Mountain Sports, your home for the Kentucky Wildcats and local high school sports. Our Appalachian Wireless Game of the Week this week had us going to Moorhead for a Pioneer Football League matchup. Moorhead State Eagles playing host to Marist on homecoming. Austin Gayhafer pumps. It's Darius Pritchett on the quick slant. Pritchett takes it in for six. 19 yards on the play, 7-0 MSU. Ensuing Marist possession, Mike White on the quarterback draw right up the gut, weaving 20 yards for the touchdown. Red Foxes tie the game at seven apiece. Next Eagle possession, Gay Hafer connects with Jalen Elliott on the quick screen and Elliott does the rest, 42 yards to the house. And that play gives Gay Hafer the all-time passing record at Moorhead State, passing former Clay County Tiger Zach Lewis, who set the record in 2012. This game would go to overtime, though, with Marist winning a thriller, 44-41. Uh, we were expecting a back-and-forth game there. Get a great offense, uh, you know, and we knew they were going to keep coming at us. Uh, credit to them. They kept playing. They were down 10 with about six minutes to go in the game. They got it tied up. But uh, credit to our guys in overtime. Big play by Mike White to Justin Christian. But this is the type of game we expect to come in here in a homecoming game. U-Pike has lost four straight overall, but trying to go 2-0 in the Mid-Southeast, hosting winless Cincinnati Christian. Some trickery from the Bears. Shannon Patrick, the backwards pass to Russell Gordon, who then throws it downfield to a wide-open Willie McLeod, falls down at the two-yard line, gain of 32 on the play. Very next play, McLeod punches it in for six. Bears take a 7-0 lead in the first quarter. Next Bears drive, the give is again to McLeod. He uses the nifty juke step to sidestep the defender, his second rushing score of the game. Bears roll in this one 59-0 over the CCU Eagles. Peyton Manning on hand for Tennessee and number one Alabama down in Knoxville. Lane Kiffin digging deep into the playbook. The reverse, Calvin Ridley to Ardarius Stewart, 34 yards down the near sideline for the touchdown. Tide lead at 7-0. Late first quarter, now the defense doing its part. Joshua Dobbs picked off on the screen attempt by Ronnie Harrison. And Harrison, nothing but green in front of him. 58 yards for the pick six. And just like that, it's a two touchdown lead. Crimson Tide have no problem with the Volunteers. 49 to 10, the final down in Knoxville. That is sports. We'll be right back.